Hi everyone, Erin here from Real Wig Fun. And today we're gonna to take a look at a brand new style from Gabor and this is called Let's Lambada and I have it in the color SS Sandy Blonde. So stay tuned. All right, many of you know, I don't typically wear short styles. So sometimes I struggle a little bit with these feeling like me. But at the end of the day, these reviews are about you and to help you along your wig journey. So although perhaps I wouldn't necessarily wear this style for me, it is a beautiful style and I wanted to bring it for you today. So this is from Gabor's 2023 Spring Luxury Collection and it is a really cute style. As you can see, Let's Lombada is a short style. It does have a bit of wave in the texture of the fibers, which is really pretty. What I love about this style the most is this asymmetrical bang. So you can see sort of this longer length on the one side. It does not flop in your face. I think that this part is the best part of this wig and that makes it very unique. I don't know if you're seeing it and perhaps it's the color that wouldn't draw those conclusions, but to me, this style looks very Kris Jenner-esque. All right, I'm gonna do a turn so that you can see Let's Lombada on all sides. So clearly this is my front. This style does not have a lace front and frankly, you don't need a lace front because of the way these fibers fall. So if you've never seen a wig without a lace front, that's what it looks like, okay? So you can wear these bangs as you wish and there's a lot of ways to play around with this style. Um, whether you wear it, you know, more forward like this or more off of your face and play around with the beautiful asymmetrical side. Okay, so here is my right side. Now, one thing that you're going to notice is I have a very low natural hairline. So I am sort of pulling this down to get the coverage that I need given that I, but my hairline is abnormally low down my neck. Okay, here is the back my left side and then back to the front. What I really love is the cut of this piece. So you can style these as you wish. You could tuck this behind your ear a little bit if you wanted or bring these fibers forward and play around with those textures. I think it's really, really pretty. So Let's Lombada has an average size cap. I have a 22 inch circumference head and this cap is fitting me very comfortably. I didn't make any adjustments out of the box, but certainly it has a Velcro adjuster so that you could adjust it for your head circumference. So Let's Lombada is made out of synthetic fiber. Specifically, it's called FlexLite, okay? And the fiber feels very soft, very fine and lifelike. I like it. Now this, you cannot apply heat to this style, um, given that it's not HD synthetic, but rather a straight synthetic fiber. So let's go ahead. I will take Let's Lombada off and I will show you its basic cap. And whenever you hear basic cap, it just means it doesn't have a lot of the bells and whistles, but frankly, that helps to keep the price point down. And I don't think that you need all the bells and whistles on this particular piece. So as you can see, you've got closed wefting. You do not have a lace front, but on here is um, a velour type fabric that's incredibly soft. So it's very comfortable on my head. And then you have open ear tabs. They do have metal stays so that you can bend them to keep that wig close to the side of your face. And then as you can see, open wefting on the sides and on the back, it has a regular nape with Velcro adjusters. So as far as the lengths on this piece, these front sections here are five and a half inches. That's that asymmetrical, beautiful length on this side of the piece, which I think is really beautiful. The crown is five inches, which is here, five inches. The sides are two and a half, the back is three and a half, and the nape is a really short 1.75 inches. And then altogether, this wig weighs only 2.4 ounces, which is gonna make it extremely lightweight and very wearable all throughout the day. So this shaded sandy blonde is a really pretty color, and it's a dark golden blonde base mixed with medium gold blonde and light 
beige blonde. So I like the fact that it's a dynamic color. I think it makes it read more natural and I think it looks very pretty on this Let's Lombata. So I hope you've enjoyed taking a quick look at Gabor's brand new Let's Lombata. If you're interested in this piece or any other wigs that I review, you can head over to wigsbypattiespearls.com. Stay well and stay safe. Bye everybody.